Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe After Effects tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to 360 degree animate text in a spherical or circular or cylindrical motion just like this. This adds a ton of production value. It's 3D, it's awesome, and it takes seconds to do. Let's get cracking. Let's start from scratch. All right, follow along with me. We've got nothing open here. The first step, new composition. 1920 by 1080, 24 frames per second. That doesn't matter, just open a composition. You don't have to worry about any of that stuff. Anything will work. The next step, grab your text tool up here at the top, and then you're gonna type in what you want it to say. So for this one, it's gonna say cylinder, and I'm using the intro font, but again, you can use any font, any size you want. I'm just gonna put that right about here. Now, let's get into the business. The next step is you wanna go to Window, Make sure there's a check mark beside effects and presets. For me, effects and presets is located here. When you go there, what you want to do is in the search in the search bar, type in this CC space cylinder. This is a free effect that comes with After Effects. Drag and drop that onto the text. When you do that, presto, we've sort of wrapped it around and we've got some 3D effect, which is awesome because we don't even have the 3D layer uh, box check. So this doesn't even require that. So I'm just going to go ahead now and I'm just going to drop down and take a look. So I'm just dropping in here. I've clicked on this little triangle. Then I'm going to click on the effects triangle, the CC cylinder triangle, and then the rotation triangle. So we're kind of digging in a little bit, but that's okay. I want to show you all of the things. So playhead at the beginning. Here's what I like to do. Again, feel free to season it as you to your taste. For CC cylinder under effects, you'll see radius percentage. I'm going to go ahead and increase that to about 150 because I want it to be a little wider just so it's easier to see. Under position, do note that you can change it, you know, move it to the side, move it up and down, etc., etc. I'm not going to do that, but I want you to be aware that that is an option if you so choose. The most important part, point here, though, is under rotation. So it's, C, it's under the effect, CC cylinder rotation. You get rotation X, Y, and Z. I'll show you what they are quickly. This is the X, and this is a really great way to add some production value and make it look cool because we're going to have it spin sort of off-center. I can rotate Y, which is what we want to rotate, and we will rotate that. And you can also rotate Z, but it doesn't, you know, it's just kind of a little weird. So what we're going to do now is, again, playhead at the beginning. I'm going to go to rotation. I'm going to go to rotation Y. I'm going to click this stopwatch, which is the starting the, basically, we're just starting keyframing it. I'm going to move the playhead to the 10 second mark or wherever you want the rotations to stop. And then watch this. I'm just going to go ahead and slowly pull this to the right. And you'll say maybe we'll do three rotations. That should be enough. So I'm going to make this somewhere around three rotations. Let's stop it right about there. And now watch this. This is already done. Bang. We have animated a 360 degree rotation text effect in After Effects in just a few seconds. Thanks for watching.